Hey guys, welcome back. I've made more progress in my entryway. If this is your first time watching, I'm doing a series of videos showing you what I did to decorate my entryway. I've added removable wallpaper, changed the light fixtures, built a bench, made a mirrored wall panel, upcycled a dresser, and now I need wall art. I wanted to share how I made an abstract wall art in case you wanted to make one as well. I believe this method I use is very easy to do and it can be customized to your liking. Let me show you what I did. First, I poured one ounce of acrylic paint into the measuring cup, then three ounces of Floetrol. Basically, I'm using a ratio one part acrylic paint to three parts of Floetrol. You can adjust how much paint you use based on the size of the canvas. If you really enjoy painting and plan on doing it a lot, I recommend pouring your paints into a squeeze bottle so you can easily store your paints away until the next project. Before I started painting, I taped the back edges of the canvas so that the paint won't drip there. Next, I pour lots of white paint over the entire canvas. This will allow the paint to flow really well on top. Then I took a couple of paint colors and poured them on the canvas to create a swirl. Next I took an air can and sprayed air across the paint. This really helped to spread the paint out as well as blend the colors. I repeated the same process and decided to try the heat gun instead. If you have a blow dryer, that will work also. I did the same thing all across the canvas. Next, I tip the canvas over to spread the paint a bit, and then I continue mixing the colors until I was happy with it. Watch me work. I also decided to add a little bit of Rust-Oleum Silver Metallic Paint. I sprayed a little bit of it into a cup off camera. This is what it looks like in the cup. I took a stick and I dragged a couple of lines of it on the canvas. Then I blowed it out. Once I was finished, I let the paint dry for two days. 
Here's a close up of it. Once it was dry, I sprayed a coat of Kmar varnish on it. This will help protect the paint. Then I added a coat of clear glaze to give it a high gloss finish. Afterwards, I removed the tape on the back and hung it on the wall. Here's how it turned out. Is this something you will try? If you do, you can always start with a small canvas. Thanks guys for watching. Be sure to come back next week for another video. Have a great week.